Let's try the trend. Hot cocoa bombs are everywhere on social media, but what's the phenomenon behind their popularity? Everyone eats with their camera first. It used to be with their eyes, now it's the camera, then the eyes, then you actually uh, enjoy your food. So I think uh, just as photogenic as they are, I think it's really just about that. And then who doesn't love hot chocolate? And especially this time of year with Valentine's Day creeping up. One local restaurant group is taking them a step further and for the 21 plus audience. So our little spin on them is actually incorporating some liquor into these. We thought, how could we take it to another level, do something different and actually incorporate a cocktail into that hot chocolate bomb. I want to say this test kitchen is where all the magic happens, but it's actually a lot of science that goes into these hot cocoa bombs. Of course, a lot of different steps to bring it all together, but inside of each of these, they found a way to solidify the booze. So we use a natural uh, gelatin that actually, when brought up to a certain temperature, uh, creates a molecular bond with the uh, liquor. So it actually nearly solidifies the liquor, so then allows us to put that uh, into the chocolate, uh, the hot cocoa bomb itself. They're complicated to make behind the scenes, but easy for you at home. Pour hot milk over the bomb and in moments, everything melts together. They're expecting this spin on the comfort food to hit the spot. Whether that's trying something, uh, you know, outside the norm that they would usually try or a twist on something that um, is nostalgic to them. And I think this is just that. In Hartford, Susie Hunter, News 8.